football has been a fantastic couple of months for you. Yeah, it has been. I mean, it was a long time out injured and uh, to get a reward for really my first start against Barnet in 1st of January or 2nd of January. So it's been a good month. I mean, got to give credit to the boys as well. Everyone's been brilliant. Four wins and we go to Plymouth and turn them over on their own patch and build a little gap. But I mean, the season's not over. 19 to go and we're in a strong position, but we've just got to keep the momentum going now. Yeah, but as a player, like as you are, to come into a team that was playing such good football, I mean, it must be a, a yeah. joy for you. Oh, it's so much easier. I mean, yeah. the way we pass it around is, that's how I want to play. I want to get on the ball. I mean, League Two is renowned for the long kick rush, and we tend not to do that when we when we can pass. We, we really do look like a, a good team. I mean, you saw that against Morecambe the other day. And uh, go again Saturday and hopefully get another three points. You mentioned you know, obviously the injury at the start of the season. It must be massively frustrating for you to... Yeah, of course. Sit on the sidelines and watch it all. Especially when you see your team winning and doing so well, you want to be part of it. And when you are injured, you feel a bit distant from everyone because there was only a couple of us out injured. I spent a lot of time with Brendan trying to get back fit, and thankfully we're both back on the pitch and, and we're doing well. Did it make you even more hungry sitting there watching, watching the uh, team play so well? Did it make you even I'm more? Not, I'm not sure. You'd never lose your hunger. It's more frustrating than that. You can't be out there because I did make an attempt to come back and I kept breaking down and stuff. So, but thankfully, it seems like I'm over them injuries and. Really looking forward to kicking on.